All right, drag six. The farmer refuted. What is going on here? That was kind of hard to follow. There's a lot going on. It goes very fast. Yeah, and like the over talking, like the, that was confusing. I'm glad I didn't know the music. I was not know what's going on. Well, even if you did, first off, what's happening musically? Um, like what's happening in the story or? Oh, no, just actually just music, just oral. You don't even know the words. It's more classical. Okay. More like it sounds high and mighty kind of thing for, because it's like about like, it's a message from the king kind of thing. It's very, yeah, I'm just But like I said, the more classical, which might indicate what in this new world of hip hop? What? It doesn't belong anymore. It doesn't belong anymore. Old fashioned. So, and, and then he moves fast over. So, even if you don't pick up the words, can you pick up the idea that this is maybe the idea of a battle between old values and new? Okay. And so, this is often, you know, it, this can be absent in fiction. But a lot of good fiction happens. Sometimes you have the hero's journey and the story of the hero, and then you also have kind of the societal overlay. You know, if, if the story is about something, if the hero is meant to represent a movement, which maybe some of you are dealing with movements in your thing, or kind of society, you often have this kind of societal overlay. If society is going through change, if society in a way is going through its own battles and hero's journey. And so I would say that's what this song is starting to set up. This, it's not just about Hamlet. This is about a battle of old ideas versus new ideas, old country versus new country. You know, all sorts of any other old versus news that you can kind of get out, take out of any of this. Can you any other kind of old versus news that you can find? We got really old ideas, new ideas. We got old country, new country. Any anything else on old versus new? Like in the way the music was? Yeah, the music, the lyrics, the battle that it's setting up. The music like in the beginning is kind of like more hip hop and yeah. it's like classical at the end. Yeah, and then they're using a little bit of old music, new music to show that battle as well. So let's see, even if you're not picking up the specifics of the words, um, if you're in tune in, like watching it does make it a little bit easier to see, you know, get humiliating. Uh, what? Some of the, um, the, if the English, so, uh, the difference between the old English, so like the hear ye, hear ye, and the e, compared to the, the newer, like yo, and things like that. That's a great point. Yeah. Hear ye versus yo. Mm -hmm. Now again, and, if we're talking about, we're getting to the section where you know, it means it's a little bit longer thing, where we're about to cross the threshold. So, in paralleling this idea of society versus um, Alexander's Hamilton story in the hero's journey, we kind of want to move across things at about the same time. Um, so, this is kind of showing me already that there is maybe a refusal to call. Not everybody in the new world is for the change. So, even though this is still somebody from the old country, the new world and it's kind of a refusal of the call, so to speak. Um, I will also say, the King George, what we're about to listen to, is I think strategically placed at a lot of key moments in the hero's journey to really clearly delineate. And he's here to delineate that, that we as a society have crossed the threshold uh, in, in the new adventure of entering into the Revolutionary War. Uh, I would say ahead, and then we'll talk. Then the song after that, Your Right Hand Man, is Hamilton's refusal of the call and then finally crossing the threshold. So we'll stop and discuss each of the songs afterwards, but maybe look and listen to it with that idea in mind that these next two steps are the various crossing the threshold of the journey. 